Hey guys, it's Leia. Today we're going to learn about how to find the limit using L'Hopital's Rule. So what is L'Hopital's Rule? It may look a little intimidating and confusing at first, but it's really not. You're given a limit as x approaches a of the function f of x over g of x. After substitution, if you get 0 over 0, or plus or minus infinity over plus or minus infinity, which are all indeterminate forms, then try taking the derivative of the numerator and the derivative of the denominator. After doing that, try substitution again, and you'll get a limit, which is equal to the limit as x approaches a of f of x over g of x. Let's try an example. The limit as x approaches 1 of ln of x over x minus 1. We'll try substitution and we'll get 0 over 0, which is an indeterminate. So let's try L'Hopital's rule. We'll first take the derivative of the numerator, ln of x, and we'll get 1 over x. Now we'll take the derivative of the denominator, x minus 1. We'll apply the sum difference rule, and we'll get the derivative of x minus the derivative of 1. We'll get 1 minus 0, and that'll simplify to 1. Now we will replace f of x and g of x with their respective derivatives. And we'll get the limit as x approaches 1 of 1 over x over 1. And that simplifies to 1 over x. We'll try substitution again. We'll put in 1 for x and we'll get 1 over 1. This simplifies to 1. We keep in mind L'Hopital's rule that the limit as x approaches a of f prime of x over g prime of x equals the limit as x approaches a of f of x over g of x. Therefore, 1 is the limit. I've always liked to use L'Hopital's rule when I can to find the limit of a function. 